think of writing the music for a show like this? Oh my gosh, it was so much fun. We've known Danielle for a long time and we love working with her. And she had this whole concept and she had the whole play and we wanted to mix it up and just have all different kinds of genres of music so we could kind of reach a bunch of people. Yeah, I think you definitely did, and especially with talking about all different holidays and then to have all different types of music. I mean, I think everyone was dancing the entire time, so it was really great. Um, and how, so how did it work? Did you, did someone write the lyrics and someone write the music? Well, she had, she gave us the script, and we kind of looked at the script, and she said, uh, she talked about uh, different topics of songs that she wanted, and then we kind of went from there, and we wrote some stuff, and then kind of presented some things, then we edited, and went back and worked again, and then we re-edited, so it was a definitely a, a true collaboration to try to get the songs to, uh, to where they are now, definitely, yeah. I think the hardest part was trying to make sure that it wasn't too Christmassy because we want this to be in schools, in elementary schools, and we want everybody to enjoy the show, not just people that celebrate Christmas. Uh, so coming up with the music, we were thinking the first song will kind of have a Christmassy sound to it, and then we'll have our heavy metal sound with a little bit of Hanukkah bells in there, dreidel sounds, and then into where uh, an Elvis song, and who doesn't like Elvis? <laughs> and then into the into a rap song because rap's always fun to do with kids right and then the we are family yeah, which yeah. everyone knows i mean everyone was singing along with you that the whole time cool. that was totally our goal and i i think the kids really played to that so so what's next for this show what are we going to see more of it what are we going to do so we are trying to get it into elementary schools so that during the holiday season they have something fun to present to their kids so that kids can actually enjoy the assembly <laughs> and yeah. teachers can enjoy it too. I student taught, I have my credential in multi-subject credential and when I was teaching in a school in LA Unified I was just everybody was bored and I hate to use that word but nobody was paying attention with the show that was brought in and so when I did that I when I saw that happening, I thought I have got to write something that the school is going to enjoy and look forward to, and more importantly, that the kids will walk away and have learned something. Because it is school, and I want kids to not just, oh, that was fun, but actually leave and tell their parents, wow, can we go volunteer, or can we go do this, or I, you know, even ask questions like what's Hanukkah or Ramadan or Kwanzaa, because so many kids now do celebrate those holidays in public schools.